So a muscle biopsy would be done uh, to evaluate uh, uh, patients that have fatigability, cramps, uh, weakness. Uh, in the test, a small specimen of muscle about the size of your uh, fingernail of your uh, pinky finger is taken either from a shoulder or a thigh muscle. And uh, then it's processed by pathologists uh, that uh, stain and then read the muscle. And through this, we can look for inflammation like a myositis or polymyositis. We can look for muscular dystrophies. We can also get information about uh, a problem of the nerve going to the muscle. Uh, that produces a very distinctive pattern of abnormality in the stain in contrast to what we would see in a muscle disorder. Uh, the biopsy is also helpful in patients that just have fatigability. Uh, there is a specific pattern that we can see in the muscle that shows up in patients that are uh, relatively inactive or have had various systemic diseases but not actually a problem of the muscle itself. So the biopsy is helpful for sorting out further problems of weakness, atrophy, and things like that.